Hello and welcome to another GTA 5 video. This is Game Right. This could be a little bit more of a casual video, so I hope you guys do enjoy. If you do, smack it with a like, leave a comment below, and let's get started. So I've got lovely accommodations first. So I've got the, the town, uh, the country, and the hills. So the town is basically the east coast of Los Santos. The country is obviously the, the plain country. Uh, the hills is obviously Beverly Hills, the, the rich side, west coast side, in the heavens. Right, so let's go to the, the hills, right? Not the, the town first, sorry. A single family home. Um, we've got Franklin and Chop the dog, who looks like a legend already. Uh, country. Got what the hell is going on there? Looks like he just smacks someone on the face, and yeah. Mobile homes are unique in that if you don't like your neighbours, you can literally move your entire house. Yeah, but it's probably simpler to just shoot them. <laughs> oh my god, I want this game so bad. It's painful. Um, a dream mini mansion. Ooh. So that's obviously where um, Mr. Michael lives, and his son's there as well. And it's also a video to watch as well, so let's watch it. Why should you visit my Blaine County? Well, besides being able to listen to my award-winning radio show on Blaine County Radio, we got everything you can want. Sand, migrants, brain bacon heat that slow roast roadkill to a scrumptious flavor. Make gravity your bitch by base jumping down Cassidy Creek, where man can truly become bird before shooting more wildlife to demonstrate our utter dominion over it. Get a souvenir that lasts a lifetime, like a tramp stamp or other well thought out tattoo. I myself enjoy the pastime of inebriation in darts at Yellow Jack's Bar and Sandy Shores. Blaine County is a peaceful land of great beauty. You will experience a whole range of emotions from hatred and paranoia to despair and depression. I'm Dwayne Earl, and this is my Blaine County. <laughs> I love these videos. Oh my god. I want to visit there so badly. Right, the next place sightseeing and celebrities. This will be fun. Um, this it's Star Tours. Oh, it stalk celebrities from the comfort of a bus. Okay, fair enough. Uh, sneak peek. Ooh, it's a magazine. So this is might be one of the celebrities we have to um, protect at one point from the paparazzi. Um, I won't read it all, but obviously you guys can go on the website and read it, but it looks pretty awesome. Let's go on to 24. Is there anything else there? It's just loads of magazines, maybe. Ooh, West Coast Classics. Got my beaches and my honeys. Bigger than the world peace. Okay, that just makes no sense. Um, <laughs> oh my god. So who's this random, this is like some wannabe celebrity that's just gone horribly wrong. Wash it up, yeah, TV fossil. Let's see her at some point, no doubt. Open around the clock for your 24 hour needs. Basically it's just a convenience store, it's not really anything else, so it's just this one, just this one screenshot basically. Got four screams here, lots of stuff happening, got the robbery happening, we can basically see what's going on. There's three mobikes outside, um, we're offline now, we can see basically we're getting away there. And it sort of starts over again, so it's got like a step-by-step guide, basically, what's going on. It's pretty cool. So we've got the smoke bombs, we've got grenades in the background, um, eye fruit mobile wrenches, suitcases, got the bug, um, cap, smoke, gas mask, plans as well. Yeah, basically, need, that's everything we need for the heist, so that's quite cool. Right, so there's one more thing to look at. It's not over yet. Also, the social club has been updated on the website, basically... We get this stuff if we sign up to it, which is going to be pretty cool. So basically just click on this link here, sign up, and you get all this stuff unlocked when you start the game. Also, lifeinvader.com, sign up to it. You can also get some discounts on like planes, clothes, haircuts and stuff as well. So first thing to speak about is this Assault SMG. It's got 60 rounds in it, in one mag. Um, basically you just get it from any animation shop, which would be pretty awesome. Also get this vehicle as well, which is for online and offline. And this one we get haircuts. Oh my god, what the hell does Michael look like? He looks like Max Payne almost. Uh, Franklin's got like this um, afro. And <laughs> Trevor's got this really cool moustache. It sort of really suits him quite a bit. But Franklin looks pretty cool, doesn't he? That afro looks full on epic. Also got this thing where you can basically check our stats on the career mode. Um, also online as well. It's basically just tracks what we're doing, how much missions we've done, the percentage of what we've done as well. So you can basically compare with our friends and all that sort of jazz. Also this thing which basically looks very similar to Instagram. Basically we can like photo share stuff, we can take pictures of ourselves using the iFruit phone, take pictures of the surrounding area, share it with friends and stuff. Basically like, it's like a way of like sharing screenshots and just trying to be creative and stuff, which would be quite cool. 
So we've also got some new screenshots as well. Got this lovely looking orange vehicle. Some massive, massive alloys. Some nice little brake uh, break discs things there as well. Looking very, very nice. Got this like spoiler thing at the front as well, which is like, basically like a way of um, adding downforce to the vehicle, so you can go around corners quicker, which is quite nice. And the next one is this one's Trevor, looking very, very determined. With a, I think it must be just a normal basic pistol with bluff fist on it, of course. Shooting this overweight dude in the basically in the chest, I think. See blood sort of spurting out in his groin region, I guess as well. Uh, as he sparks come out the vehicle, looks awesome. Let's go for the next one. Another plane. So this is some of the customization we can do to some of our planes. This lovely, like bright green, luminous colours, which looks insane. Look at the detail in the. Oh, that is crazy. Also, this fog will be used to basically uh, stop the frames going up too high. So you will see this little fog sometimes if you can see quite far into the distance. But it looks pretty cool. Next one's Michael, sort of reflecting perhaps um, on the hills and just sort of looking over Los Santos. Perhaps questioning himself, like, what am I doing? What am I doing here? And what do I do next? Uh, amazing sights, though. Crazy. Next one, another bit of lighting in there. Looking very nice. I'm not sure where this is, but it looks pretty spooky in some ways. Um, it'd be quite cool to go across that with, like, a motorbike or something. So this is the last one. This is, like, um, I think this may be taken from online. Got this guy with, I think, maybe an M4 gun and assault rifle or SMG. And this, this stupid cop, this bull cop, trying to take him out. Obviously, it's in cover, so he's staying safe. But you can see some of the vehicles, the vehicle holes. And um, got this tow, this tow truck behind as well. I'm guessing this is probably taken during a heist because he's got like the suit on, he's ready to go. Um, I'm not sure where he is, but pretty epic screenshots. I think that might be the last set we ever see ever, which is going to be uh, quite depressing. I hope you guys enjoyed this video though. Smack of a like, leave a comment, and yeah, hope you guys want to see more very, very soon when the game comes out next Tuesday. Bye bye.